Hey, what is up guys? Brandon is here and welcome to the third annual Pokemon CCG birthday opening. Yes, today is my birthday. I know the camera is a little bit up, but like I said in the last, um, in my booster box opening of Ultra Prism, I use my iPad as a, um, as a uh, camera for these things because, I mean, I don't really vlog, I don't really do anything, but I do this. And, of course, I'm a college student on a budget, so why not? But, I got this new iPad for my birthday. This is the new, right on the screen, that's the new iPad 10 point, iPad Pro 10.5 inch. I, I was very surprised because this has 256 gigs, so I'll have no problems like I did recording my booster box opening. I'm sorry, I chewed on my fingers. But, anyways, yeah, today's my birthday. I am 21 today as of... As I'm recording this, this is March 24th. I'm 21. It's a big year. So, I decided, why not have a big opening? Why not have something bigger and better? Now, in the past couple years, I've had my big openings. It's been, maybe, a box of Pokemon cards, a Lucario GX box. Now, that's all cool and all, but wait... What if I told you another box, this time of the Pokemon Shining Legends Shiny Darkrai Edition. Now, this will be a pretty long video, I'm and like I said, I'm recording this at like 10 o'clock on 24, so I'm trying to get this done fast. I'll get it edited fast, and uh, you'll, you're, you guys are watching it, so depending, it might be, you might be watching it on the 25th at a late at midnight, or later in the day on the 25th, but... Never fear, I did film this on my birthday. So without further ado, we're going to start with our Shining Legends box. Then we're going to end with our Lucario GX box. Since this is, I think this is newer, I mean, this is newer than this one. And of course, who doesn't like Shining Legends? So without further ado, let me set this down. And I'm going to get this baby unboxed. Without further ado, speed up! Alright, and we are back, so, before we get started, today, of course, here, let me, there we go, it's a better camera too, so it should be much clearer, 1080, 60 FPS for you guys, but as you can see, I got my Pokemon 2016, they're a little beat up, I'm not gonna lie, I had, we've, since I'm um, getting these, we've had a new puppy, so, uh, she's a little handful, and she likes to chew, she used to like to chew on things. But I got those for our card slaves. I just got the whole pile because who knows? With Shining Legends, we could get a lot. So today, of course, we got with uh, within the Shining Legends box four Pokemon Shining Legends booster packs. We got two Mewtwo's, a Shiny Mew, and a Shiny Genesect. Who knows? Maybe we'll get the secret rare, um, secret rare uh, Mewtwo GX. Um, I've actually opened. I think it was the Raichu GX box. I got it for Christmas. Um, actually, I think I got it. I forget when I got it. But I got it, and um, I didn't do a video on it because I really wanted to open it. And I got this, that card right there. It is the Rainbow Rare Entei, and it's a great card, and uh, it's beautiful. So we got four packs right there. Of course, um, we also got, since this is a figure box, this, hot, this really cool... Dark Rye figurine. I mean, look at that baby. Look at it. It's shiny Dark Rye, so of course he looks more purple than black. I do like the shiny Dark Rye. I do like shiny Dark Rye. So shinies, and a lot of and a lot of people will agree, kind of are a hit or miss on their coloring because of course they're alternate colorings. I remember um, in uh, when I was playing Pokemon uh, Leaf Green, which was one of my first GBA games. Um, I saw, and I don't think when I was playing through Crystal or Gold, I saw a Shiny, but I saw a Shiny Swine Up. And I still have that Shiny Swine Up on that Pokemon Leaf Green save to this day. I don't have any way of transferring it to, um, my Pokemon Ultra Moon, um, yet. 
but hopefully maybe in the future I'll be able to get that. So we're going to say you right here next to the packs. Uh, yeah, he's not going to want to stand up. You, you, you can just sit to the side here. Of course, I got my code card right here. This will give me um, all the packs in here along with my the promo, which I'm keeping this. I'm sorry. Um, actually, I've, I think I can give these. I think these have code cards. Um, hold on. Let me check. Okay, this is just this is just this shiny dark eye. So this is mine to keep. I'm sorry, but I will give out um, one of these um, packs maybe because it is my birthday. So I'm I'm being generous. I'm gonna give you one of these packs. I'll be generous. I'll give you and I'll give you out one of the four packs in the Lucario GX. But this is mine. I'm sorry. And of course, the main event. We're gonna slip him into a card sleeve before I show him off to the world. Let me get a better card sleeve because that's a little. Like, gross. I need to clean some of these card sleeves because, like I said, some of them are not in the best shape because of puppies and puppy. And uh, it's funny because uh, Burning Shadows. Oh, this is an alternate version. This is actually my first alternate version card. Uh, this is Shiny Dark Rye. And if it looks familiar, it's because the artwork is in Burning Shadows. That's why it's 88A because it is... Um, an alternate version of that GX, Dark Ride GX card. But if you don't know what this GX card is all about, I'll read it off to you. We got a Dark Ride GX with 180 HP. Not that much by GX standards, I gotta say, and some EX standards. It has the ability of restoration once during your turn before your attack. If this Pokemon is in your discard pile, you may put it onto your bench then attach a dark energy card from your discard pile to this Pokemon, which is not a bad, not a bad um, ability, I gotta say. And then it has the attack Dark Cleave for 130 damage for two, two darkness energies and a colorless energy for 130 damage. No, and it, but it doesn't reflect the resistance. I gotta say that's not a bad attack, and for the same amount for that same two dark energy and colorless energy, we got ourselves. Uh, dark, Dead End GX, which is a GX move, and if you don't know, you can only use one GX move per turn. And just like uh, EX Pokemon, when your Pokemon GX is knocked out, your opponent takes two prize cards. It's the same way with EX cards. But anyways, with Dead End GX, it says if your opponent's active Pokemon is affected by a special condition, that Pokemon is knocked out. So, bam, it's just taken away. Um, which is kind of sad. You gotta make sure you have a Pokemon that can affect it by condition, because none of his attacks or his his ability, none of, uh, I mean, his attack or his ability does not affect you with a, um, with a uh, special condition. So you need an extra Pokemon to deal that, then swap it onto the field if you really want to take out, like, a powerful GX, and, uh, bam. I mean, it's pretty good GX, I'm not gonna lie. I like the shiny... Um, variant of it. We're going to set you to the back and we're going to get started on um, this. We're going to finish off with our boy Mewtwo. Uh, actually, we're going to finish off with our... I'm just going to say girl because Mew just always reminded me as a girl growing up and I actually got this shiny Mew, Mew card. Got it from an opening that I didn't do on camera. I didn't do a lot of my shiny Legends openings. I wanted to first. It was corrupted and then, I mean, I just... Didn't feel like it was like during days that I just didn't want to record. But anyways, here we go. First pack, Shiny Genesex. Let's see what we get. Do we get a Shiny variant? Do we get a GX? Let's see if Genesex can bless us with some good pulls. All right. Let's see. Um, is there a co-card? Maybe not. Maybe. I think it's a co There's co-cards. Yes, there is. Okay. So here. Here. I'm going to shift it around. I'm not looking at the code card. I just saw white. So, because I saw the back of it, it was, okay, three, two, one. No, hold, hold on. <laughs> saw the code. Okay, three, two, one. I don't think it showed up on camera, but bam. Ooh, white code. Yes. Okay, we're getting a pool. I think usually you get a pool. I think it's like one, two, three, four from that, if I'm not mistaken. No, it's, it's three. It's three from that. But still, nonetheless, let's go on our first pack on this journey in this video. Okay, we got a Fairy-type Energy, Sophilies, um, Lily. I actually got, and 
uh, both of the, her full arts so far in uh, the Sun and Moon uh, TCG series. Pokemon Breeder, Breloom, Tora Cat, Ekans, Pikachu, Rainbow Pikachu, yeah, Jinx, Fabulous, uh, Reverse Sophilies, and our rare is a Hollow Hoopa. Hollow Hoopaling. I think I got the non hollow version. I don't know. I gotta check in my binders once the, I'm done with this video. But we shall go over. Let me put these cards to the side over here with and make the pack pile. And we will go over this hollow. Okay, Hoopa. It's a dark type compared to um, the other cards I have of it, which makes it a psychic. Um, it has 120 HP, has the ability Scoundrel Guard, prevent all effects of attacks, including damage down to this Pokemon by your opponent's Pokemon GX or Pokemon EX. That's actually a pretty OP, um, OP thing. I think there were a couple cards, uh, I mean OP ability, I think there were a couple cards, um, I think there's a Suicune with the ability, um, back from like a black and white set, and, uh, it, it, its ability is kind of similar. And uh, I think it's basic Pokemon instead of Pokemon EX, or I think it might be Pokemon EX, but it can't be affected, and it's kind of similar ability, if you know what I'm talking about. And then it has the attack, which does 80 damage, Super Psy Bolt, which is kind of redundant since it's a Dark type, and Dark type is super effective against whatever. It goes for one Dark Energy and two Colorless for 80 damage, which is not a bad Hollow, not a bad Hollow, not a bad pool. Alrighty. Moving on, our first boy Mewtwo sliding into our DMs. Okay, let me set this code card, and I will choose one of the code cards for you guys to have. And, uh, ooh, I don't think I got a Shroomish. Okay, yeah. Oh, this one's actually, this one's actually correct. Three, two, one. Ah, yes. Alrighty. So, set you to the side here. One, two, three. Three, four from the back. Yeah, four. Okay. It was four. Maybe I grabbed four accidentally and I just didn't I didn't uh, realize. Okay, we got ourselves a water energy super scoop up. <laughs> Warp energy. I like some special energies. Shroomish. I don't think I got that shroomish, so a new card of the set. I'm only missing Ooh, I don't have think I have the quillfish. That's cool. I'd be sore. Porkle. One of my favorite Pokemon. My favorite Pokemon on Ash's Hoenn team by far, honestly. I just love Torkoal. Bulbasaur, always, Bulbasaur is always nice. A Reverse Volcarona, and our rare is a none other than a Hollow Verizian. I think we, I doubled up on a Hollow um, because um, I'm pretty sure that's a Hollow I've gotten from Shiny Legends. Shining Legends, not Shiny Legends. But, I mean, nonetheless, we're going to go over it. Has 110 HP grass type, of course. Has, for one grass energy, 30 damage wrapping in wind. You may attach a basic energy card from your hand to this Pokemon. Not a bad sack. And then Pike, for 90 damage, costs two grass energies and a colorless. This attack does 30 damage to one of your opponent's bench Pokemon. Not a bad card by any means. We're going to say you to the back. All right, I'm pretty sure that's a hollow I've gotten before. Okay, me too. Come on, can you give us a shiny? Can you give us a GX? Or will Mew have the um, card that will finish us off for the finale of this box? Who knows? Okay, three, two, one. Yes! White code. I think these are all going to be white codes, actually. I don't think I've ever seen a green code for a uh, Shining Legends box. But without further ado, here we go. We got ourselves a our basic energy, lightning energy. Ultra Ball! Ultra Ball is always cool. I remember Darien's Pokemon uh, doing a search for Ultra Ball. I think they still do it sometimes. Lyperd. Uh, another Volcarona. Non-Reverse. Toracat. Plusle. And Minin. Hey. Uh, Zora. Ivysaur. Torkoon! A Reverse. Stunfisk. And our rare is none other. No. Okay, this is... I doubled up on a rainbow <laughs> Oh, what are the chances? I doubled up. This is the first time I've ever doubled up on a rainbow rare. But it's a rainbow rare. So what am I going to complain 
And uh, you see it, I, I showed you the rainbow rare. Oh, the lighting is just not horrible, but the light, it looks so beautiful. Oh, there we go. There we go. If I tilt it that way, you guys can see it's all glory, all its glory. But I showed you a picture of it, so just go back and read about that. That's, that stuns me. I, I've never done that before, mostly because of how freaking rare rainbow rares are. But that's legit my second one, because like I said, I got it in a opening that I did not record. All right. Okay, Mew, you, if you don't give us a shiny or anything, I mean, it's a, a, this box is actually pretty much made. I do not care if it's not a new rainbow rare, you know. Rainbow rares are rainbow rares, like I said. I, I'm totally fine with that. I am. That is a great birthday surprise. Because, I mean, doubling up on a GX. That's pretty cool and all. Dumb up on a Rainbow Lair. Now that's hardcore. Okay, three, two, one. We got another white code. Let's see what Mew has in store for us to finish off this opening. All right. Here we go. Last pack of this box. And then we'll move on to Lucario GX. All right. We got ourselves our basic energy fairy. Pokemon Breeder. Spiritomb. Volcarona, Zora, plus old hand mining, Tor another tour cat. We got a lot of tour cats. Breloom, Larvesta, a reverse mining, and plus old. And our last card, our rare, is none other than another hollow I've doubled up on. This is a small, small set, so like I'm expecting it. But a hollow Resha Ram. Oh, that's a not that great of a. There we go. That's a better uh, in card sleeves. So that's why I brought the whole stack, because I know some of them aren't in the best condition. I wonder if you could keep clean card sleeves. But I don't think I opened this on camera before, so I'm going to read it off. Rush Rim, 130 HP Outrage, which is always a cool freaking move, because for every it does 10 or more damage for each damage counter on the Pokemon. So if you have 120 damage, that's 140 damage right there. Um, you get 120 plus damage to the 20 and you get 140 and then that's for two colorless energy and for two fire and a colorless scorching breath 130 but the pokemon cannot attack next turn here we go we're just gonna we, we're going to here let me throw these over here throw the pack over here and we're just gonna go through the this box's um pools right here now you know okay Okay, so of course, we got in this box, in this part of the opening, we got ourselves a Hollow Hoopa, a Hollow Verizian, a uh, Hollow that I think I doubled up on. I know I doubled up on this Hollow Reshiram. Of course, the promo, the big boy of the box, Shiny Dark Eye, and of course, a doubled Rainbow Rare, which I do not care if it's a double Rainbow Rare. It's a Rainbow Rare. So, that's pretty cool. I'm going to set you to the side, and we'll do a full recap. I also got this. It was in here. It's a Pokemon Center like card right here, and uh, it has a little cool thing. I like that mug. I actually do like the mug. I might want that actual mug. I like that Pikachu from Pokemon Yellow. I like that Mew Mikyu. And... Okay, anyways, got to set the right off to the side. And, of course, we got ourselves four co-cards. Which co-card will I choose? Uh, I'll give you this co-card. Bam! There you go. Take that code and enjoy uh, my birthday present to you guys, you know. Um, thank you. And I'll set these code cards in my pile along with the promo code. I'm only getting out two promo cards. But anyways, it is time for the second box. And uh, three, and we will just quickly unbox this. Speed up! And I'm back. So, yeah, we got ourselves unboxed. Of course, we will look over this real quick. Um, but first, let's, let's zoom in right here. So, of course, we got our four packs. We got a pretty good variety. I mean, we got ourselves a Burning Shadows, one of my favorite sets. 
we got ourselves a Crimson Invasion, an Ultra Prism, and an Ancient Origins, which is pretty cool. So we could get an EX in this part. We'll start with that, of course, through the pack, and we'll move on through the older and get to and the end with the Ultra Prism. So yeah, we're gonna do that. And actually, we're gonna look at instead of the. Okay, so we're actually gonna look at the smaller version. But this is basically the giant promo. It looks the same exact way. Um, we're gonna move you to the side, actually, back there. All the way back there, actually. And we are going to sleeve up the actual promo that's worth a damn, you know? Because the although it's bent, it's a little warped, but it's not too bad. I mean, okay, and let's uh, focus on you. So, yeah, this is the Lucario GX, and this is actually a pretty good, and um, I watched uh, a Darium video. They, they're doing a, every Pokemon product opening sorry it's a little it's a little just uh dirty the card sleeve but anyways they're doing a new series called every product opening like like i always say please here i'm gonna i'm gonna put it in a better card sleeve than that so i want you to be able to see it in all its glory but you know can't do that if there's stuff smearing on there we go that's better, that's better, that's much, much better. Oh, wait. Is that the card? Oh, that's the card. Okay, never mind. But anyways, um, they're doing an every product opening ever now series. L like, uh, because I talk about them so much, link will be in the description to their channel and their website. Go check them out and give them some love. Buy Pokemon products from them. Whatever. They're, it's not sponsored. I just love them as a YouTube channel and as a... Uh, a Pokemon TCG store, so go give them some love in any way you can. But Lucario GX, they say, is probably going to be a great um, addition to the rotation of uh, Pokemon TCG um, play styles and decks. Um, Lucario GX is actually going to be in the next set, um, but this is a promo. It's coming out early. I don't know if it's going to have the same attacks, but for this Lucario GX, of course, you have to revolve it from Riolu because it is an evolution Pokemon, and GXs aren't like EXs. They're not just basic types straight away. It has 210 damage. It has its great attack of if this Pokemon evolved from Riolu during this, this turn that you play it. I... It does 90 board damage, so it could do 100 damage for one fighting energy just if you evolved it on this turn, the same turn that you're attacking. And then it also has, with no penalties, Cyclone Kick for two fighting energy and a colorless 130 damage just straight up. That's actually a pretty crazy attack. That has a pretty impressive GX move called uh, Cantankerous Beatdown GX, 30 times attack for two colorless energies. This attack does 30 damage for each damage counter on this Pokemon, which is pretty much like Rage, only you could get up to 200, and that could be, uh, that's 20, so that's 600 damage straight up if you just get down to the little 10 HP, you know, but that's nuts, and of course, as a retreat cost of, uh, to retreat, which is not too bad, actually, so if you get low and you want to save this, just set it on your bench and put somebody else in, and it's, and it's, Promo number 100. Hold on. I want to see real quick. What promo? Oh, it's not even a promo. Oh, it's not a promo. That sucks. But anyways, it's promo number 100, so that's pretty cool. We're going to set you in the back right there. We're going to get started on these packs. And, of course, I got this. This just is the code card for the promo, and this is going to be mine personally. But I will give out one of these code cards and uh, I'll just shuffle them up, and um, I won't even be biased on what pack I'm giving to you. So, without further ado, we're going to get started and get through the second box for my birthday opening of X and Y Ancient Origin. I haven't opened a pack of these in a while, actually. Ooh, wow, that opened up really easily. I was not expecting that to. Oh, white code, we're getting at least a hollow set you right there. Hey, yeah. Get okay, one, two, three from the back instead of the standard four nowadays. All right, we got ourselves a, a Gimme or Sligo. Sligo. Uh, Porygon 2. Uh, Energy Recycler. Yeah, the cards are much thicker. 
then the sun and moon are um the sun and moon sets are Gumi, there's Gumi. Hey Whooper, just chilling out there. I have a lot of these cards, so Spinarak, Quagsire, Nezuko, a reverse level ball, and our rare is none of Is that an EX? Is that Mega Tyranitar EX? Ha <laughs> ha! We did get an EX! That's that's crazy! I was not actually expecting, like, legit, I was not expecting an EX from, sorry, my dogs are like, what's going on in there? He just, he just yelled, but a Mega Tyranitar GX, that's not a bad pull. I don't have that E, I mean, not GX, EX, I don't have a regular Ty Tyranitar EX or this card, so it's a win-win for me, and let's go over, a lot of you may know this, but of course, Tyranitar GX, Mega Tyranitar GX evolves from Tyranitar EX. Yeah. I mean, Sun and Moon, you got me confused. Mega Tyranitar EX evolves from Tyranitar EX. And uh, it has 240 HP. It has an ability called Double This May Pokemon may have up to two Pokemon Tool cards up attached to it. And it has a Mega Evolution rule. When one of your Pokemon become a Mega Evolution Pokemon, your turn ends. But of course, there's a Pokemon Tool that you could attach to your... Um, Pokemon EX that you're Mega Evolving that allows you to not end your turn after Mega Evolving it. And of course, it has the one attack for two Darkness Energy and two Colorless Energy Destroyer King for 110 plus damage. This attack does 60 more damage for each damage counter on your opponent's active Pokemon. So that's actually pretty nuts because I think they're, um, I think Mega Tyrant, I mean, just Tyrant or EX has like an attack that does 60 or 80. So if you do that and then you Mega Evolve with that Pokemon Tool card attached to it, that's a win win right there. You could do up to like maybe, uh, that's, that's actually pretty OP. I'm not even going to try and do the math. But of course, just like I said, Pokemon GX adapts to the Pokemon EX rule when a Pokemon EX has been knocked out. Your opponent takes two prize cards, which if you don't know how Pokemon TGG um, battles work, um, you have six prize cards on the field, and of course, um, every time you knock out a regular Pokemon, a opponent um, ta well, takes one of his prize cards. Not your prize cards, his prize cards. So one, whoever um, loses all their prize cards and actually has them, wins. So it, it's confusing, yes, but uh, yeah. But it has a retreat cross of four energy, so that's not that great. But I was not expecting an EX. That's a great pool. Okay, moving on to one of my favorite Pokemon Sun and Moon. My second favorite Pokemon Sun and Moon set, Burning Shadows. Let's go. Okay, let's see. What kind of code are we getting? Are we getting another white code or green code? Green code! Oh. You're not going to be giving me anything good, are you? It's okay, friend. Okay, yeah, four from the back in this one as well. Alright, we got our basic energy, Grass, Seedra, cool. Rotom Dex, Poke Finder Mode, Super Scoop Up, Sandy Ghast, Venipede, Horsey, aw, I love hand-drawn artwork like that. Mudbray, Ladyba, a reverse Seedra, and our rare is none other than Crab Bop. Crabominable. So, yeah, not that great of a pack right there, but that's okay. We got an EX. Like, that's unexpected. This is my first time ever opening Crimson Invasion, because I think. No, I, I think I did a mini pack opening. I'm pretty sure. But, anyways, if I didn't, first one opening, and uh, let's see. Did we get a. Oh, shit. Hold on. I'm not even looking at it. I'm not even looking at the code card. Okay, three, two, one. Uh, green code. Yeah, that was just my luck when I was opening it initially. Um, the f last time I opened it. Okay, four from the back. All right, we got ourselves a our standard energy of psychic counter energy. I think that's actually a new energy. That's pretty sick. That's pretty dope. Uh, fighting memory for Sivali GX. Um, counter catcher. Oh, Chubby Pikachu. Nobody, um, somebody on Darium's channel doesn't, um, one of them, uh, of the employees doesn't like this artwork because of how chubby he is, but I like it. I like how, okay, Skidoo. Oh, uh, yeah, you should be panicked. Look at all those trees. Starly. Uh, yeah. 
I wish he, he was saved for- Ooh, Sandlet Psychic. I know he's a poison. It's supposed to be because he's poison, but fire, but... Okay, um... A Shelmet. A reverse is none other than Sea of Nothingness. I think that's... Yeah, that's an Ultra Beast Sea, I'm pretty sure. And our rare is Alteria. Not a bad rare. I don't think I have that rare. But, not bad. Alright, now it's all down to Leafeon of Ultra Prism. My all-time best booster box. Opening, but, okay. Can we have the luck? Can we have luck with Ultra Prism again? 3, 2, 1. Alright. I'm just going to give away this code because uh, this, and it is a green code. I'm sorry, guys. That's going to be the code that you're going to get. But, it was derpy, but I'll give you the code. You know, I wasn't, I wasn't thinking. Last pack! Although it's a green code, we had a pretty good Pokemon annual, third annual uh, open. A birthday opening so we got ourselves our standard fighting energy mars the one thing i love about this set is all of the um Sinnoh nostalgia turtonator uh lupiny oh yeah lupiny cosmog roselia young goose stonky uh lolan of vulpix i like that artwork i actually do a reverse shinx Ooh, look at that shine Look at the shine. I, they actually went over onto the picture. I don't think they've done that in a while. And our rare is none other than Drapion. But that is not a bad pull. Of course, we got ourselves these two cards, these two bad boys. Lucario GX promo. And of course, a EX, which I was not expecting. Along with uh, the Rainbow Rare and all these cool cards. And don't forget... This was, unfortunately, your code card, the last pack. It was a green code. I'm sorry, but I saw it. I wasn't going to be biased, and it just so happened. This is going to be your code. It's going to be Ultra Prism, so go redeem that. Please take one of the two codes for yourself. But anyways, like I said, I'm recording this on my birthday, so I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you wish me a cool, happy birthday. And honestly, I don't feel any different because, like, I... 18, 18 was a big year, it's when you're an adult, but as you get older, guys, it's, it's not that much different, it, you don't feel the change, it's not that much of an impact, and you, then some people say, oh, you get to drink alcohol now, personally, don't see the appeal, but that's just me, but anyways, this has been my Pokemon birthday, third annual birthday opening, I can't believe I got this, and I hope you guys enjoyed, please take one co-card, if you liked this video, if you did, leave a like and comment down below. Read all your comments. Also, subscribe to become part of Barbaricus Legion. We are growing every day, and hopefully this year is going to be better than last. I can't believe I'm... This is actually, I think... Yeah, I've been doing this for three years now, although I have a small growth on my channel. It's 150 people is nuts, and I can't believe that's how many people are subbed. But anyways, like I said, I hope you enjoyed. If you want to see more Pokemon pack opening, Pokemon pack TCG pack openings like this, link will be in the description below, as well as an annotation right there, so you can go check that out, as well as the end of the video. And that's all I have for you today. And as always, I'll play with you guys, game with you guys, and so out to you guys later. Stay awesome. Gotta catch them all. See you next week. Yeah.